Hi, I'm Tom McMillan, senior pastor at John Knox Presbyterian Church. We want to invite you to worship with us at 10 o'clock on Sunday, either in person or online. Has anybody ever said to you that you can't do a certain thing? You can't uh, speak a certain opinion. You can't get out of your lane. They want you to kind of keep you in a certain role. And you say, no, <laughs> I, I need to say this. I need to do this. I need to be involved with this world beyond just my own concerns. Now, that's what we find when Christ has risen from the grave and the Spirit of God has now been sent and the community is waking up and they're getting involved with the needs that are around them by the power of God. That's what we have in the story in Acts chapter 9 where Peter is summoned from a nearby community where he has just healed a man who's been paralyzed and he's called by widows in a community that are grieving the death of a woman named Tabitha which in Aramaic means gazelle. Tabitha was a leader and provided for the poor in that area and the widows are grieving and Peter is summoned to come and basically brings her back to life. And so here you have a fisherman who is now in the healing industry. You have a paralyzed man who is not really obeying his doctor's orders and is brought now to life changing his neighborhood. And Tabitha, who though a widow is now incredibly involved with the needs of the poor and a community of widows that has been influenced by her and now celebrates her life renewed. So how are you kind of waking up? How are you coming to life? How are you discovering your place in bringing healing, help, and sometimes saying no to those who may want you to be silenced because you have something to say and something to do that brings healing and hope to your world. Come on Sunday and let's be a part of that conversation. We'll see you then.